Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set from CAD 2020, slot 1 DILR, is based on a 4 set Venn diagram. It says that there are 1000 patients currently suffering from a disease. They were selected to study the effectiveness of a treatment of four types of medicines A, B, C, and D. And these patients were first randomly assigned into two groups of equal size called treatment group and control group. The patients in the control group were not treated. So only 500 will be treated. Okay, the, instead they were given a dummy medicine placebo fine. The following information is known about the patients in the treatment group. So there are 500 patients in the treatment group. Okay, so we have uh, like four different types of medicine. People are given different combinations of medicines. So we shall have a four set Venn diagram like this. Now, in this Venn diagram, this is how we draw a four set Venn diagram. This region represents A. This region represents B. This complete region represents C. And similarly, this region represents D. And uh, Overlap regions will re uh, represent things according like for example, this is A and this is B also and this is C also. This is all four A, B, C, D. So you can see the overlapping regions and find out the values. Now this was a pretty simple set. Most of the values are already given to us. So directly start putting the values. It says A, a total of 250 patients were treated with type A medicine and 210 patients with type C medicine. So A you have to give to 250 patients and C you have to give to 210 patients. So this does not mean that this is 210. It means the entire region within C will be 210. So this region will be 210. 25 patients were treated with type A medicine only. So 25 here, 20 with C only. So 20 here, then 10 with D only. So D only is 10, okay. Then 35 patients were treated with type A and type D medicines only. 35 with A and D only. Now this is the portion which has overlap of A and D. This is inside A also. And this is inside D also. So this region is 35. So it is about just putting the regions. 20 patients type A and type B only. So 20 will come in this part. 30 patients A and C only. So this is 30. 20 patients C and D only. So 20 here. Okay. Now, 100 patients were treated with exactly three types of medicine. Now, which are those people who are treated with three types of medicines? So, we will be representing the region here. These people are treated with three types of medicine. These people are treated with three types of medicine. Like you can say A, C and D. Similarly, this is three types of medicine, A, B and D. And the fourth region is this. So we are given that the total of the people who are treated with three types of medicine is 100. Okay. Now next value is given to us in the next statement which says that 40 patients were treated with A, B and C but not D. Okay. So A, B, C. A, B is common in this line and C is here. So this value is 40. A, B is common in this line and if you take this one, this includes A, B and D. Now, 20 patients were treated with A, C, D. A, C, D, this is 20. This is also done. Last condition says 50 patients were given all four types of medicine. So, all four is this central one and it is 50. 75 patients were treated with exactly one type of medicine. Exactly 1 is the sum of these. Now this is 20, 30 and uh, 55. So this shall be 20. So this is also done. Now we have used all the statements. Now how to find out the remaining 4 values? 
we will subtract from the totals. Now this is a missing word number from the total of 250. So add all others. So we have 20, 30, 50, 50, 50, 100. 100 plus 60, 160. 160 plus 60, that is 220. Okay. So this value will be 30. Okay. So 250 is matched. Now we said 100 people are treated with three types of medicine. So this is 40. 20 and 30, total 90, this value is going to be 10, okay. So this is also done. Now we have the total of CS 210. So let's add these 30, 20, 50, 100, 140, 140 plus 50, 190. This number shall be 20, okay. Now this number remains. How to find this number is there are total 500 patients who are treated with medicines, okay. So we need to put a total of 500 here. Now A is already 250. 20 and uh, 20, 20, 10, 50, that is 300. 300 plus 50, 350 shall be 150. So this is how we will complete the Venn diagram. It was easy to fill as most of the data was already given to us. Now let us answer the questions based on it. So first question is how many patients were treated with type medicine type B. So add all the values of B. So we have 150 plus 50, 200, 230, 240, 280, 300, 320, 340. So 340 patients treated with medicine type the number of patients who were treated with types B, C and D but not type A. B, C and D. So this is B. This is C. Okay. So something common in this and D also. So B, C and D but not A. Okay, so the value is 10. How many patients were treated with medicines types B and D only? So B and D is this region. 150. Number of patients who were treated with medicine type D. So we need to add these numbers to get the sum. So 150, 50, 200, 200 plus 40, 240, 270, 290 and 35 is 325. So this was the solution to the set and the answers to the questions.